डिस्कस द इम्पैक्ट ऑफ प्लास्टिक पोल्यूशन ऑन मरीन बायोडाइवर्सिटी इन इंडिया सजेस्ट रेमिडियल मेजर्स अगेन सी माई ऑब्जेक्टिव इज these kind of answers should be written with some amount of thinking on your own hum to padha denge argue data also we have a proper answer with data facts examples we have some data we have some set of uh, uh, say say details but agar ye puchta aap if they ask this to you without you being ready for it a bada specific hai na okay plastic pollution hai and asking marine biodiversity and very specific india mein ho gaya batao okay you have to try to answer on your own so so think of the same format you have got introduction you'll have a diagram you'll have to have some body based discussions and you have conclusions okay so introduction introduction so in general i lay down that that plastic pollution plastic pollution is uh, a, a, a new dimension dimension in ocean environmental degradation in recent years in uh, uh, recent years can you give me some specifics about plastic pollution can you give me some terms some specifics about plastic pollution let's see what type of plastics what type of size non degradable okay what else okay plastic hai to yes microplastics nanoplastics what else can you mention specific aur kuch bata sakte ho aap mujhe micron plastic less than 15 microns yes single use bas bas utna kafi hai micro beads yes that's the idea so in recent times is recent times uh, plastic pollution has has included microplastics it has included okay microplastic beads okay size of less than uh, 15 microns yahi topic likhna hai yahi likhna hai aapko there is an increase in uh, single use plastics okay that has been uh, polluting the oceans okay indian ocean indian ocean to uh, because see aapka bada specific hai talk about india okay so indian ocean plastic pollution pollution has also uh, uh, been a major concern that's all what is what is plastic pollution if you know more details theek hai otherwise indian ocean has also been an important concern now you tell me now you tell me if i am talking about plastic pollution now you tell me in the diagram what do you want to add dobara question dekho aap okay discuss the impact of impact of plastic pollution and suggest remedies so in the diagram what do you want me to add use a map maybe yes you also have a chart of impacts yes now you tell me in india which areas must have had very high incidence of plastic pollution maine kuch padha nahi i have not read anything you tell me what do you think yes correct near the big cities correct high population density states correct <laughs> of course ranjit coastal areas mein to hona hi hona hai okay <laughs> agar aap seas ki baat kar rahe ho to coast mein hi hoga that i know oh, western coast has a bit more okay accepted yes island regions okay but not all islands may be okay mumbai goa chilka talk about lagoons no lagoons may high incidences along the transport that's it yahi char panch is good enough so i can have a map on i can ha have a map on the the uh, 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 regional distribution of plastic pollution in uh, or along along uh, indian coasts along indian coasts so i have drawn the map of india like okay, i have shown the along the uh, the pollution areas of high cities kolkata coast mumbai coast part of gujarat coast i can show andhra coast tamil nadu coast basically sara mujhe mark karna hai leaving some some small small gaps that's all theek okay, hai what are the areas and can you tell me uh, which area must have had the maximum pollution 
बताओ मुझे अब क्या लगता है मैक्सिमम कौन सा होगा मोस्ट पोल्यूटेड एरियाज बिकॉज ऑफ प्लास्टिक पोल्यूशन इफ आई वॉन्ट टू गिव यू गिव वन और टू एग्जाम्पल्स कौन सा होगा आई विल टॉक अबाउट द मुंबई कोस्ट आई विल टॉक अबाउट द वेस्ट बेंगाल कोस्ट यस क्योंकि इंडस्ट्रियल बेल्ट यस सो गुजरात दैट्स ऑल यहां पर एड कर देना ओके द हाइएस्ट इंसिडेंसेस ऑफ ओके प्लास्टिक पोल्यूशन ऑफ ओ एफ एफ ऑफ ओके ऑफ मुंबई कोस्ट गुजरात बरूच कोस्ट ऑफ गल्फ ऑफ कैम्बे एंड प्रोबेबली वेस्ट बेंगाल कोस्ट एंड मे बी तमिलनाडु कोस्ट आई डू सम जॉटिंग्स हियर ओके सी यू विल हैव टू बी स्मार्ट हियर ओके सारा आपको एंसर पता हो इम्पॉसिबल है But can you draw a diagram of this kind? Yes, absolutely. We say plastic pollution is not so much because of fishing. Fishing is one of them. Okay, you know, bulk of the plastic pollution happens because of solar-based disintegration. When they come exposed to sunlight, warm waters, and salinity, there's disintegration, and because of it, yes. Okay, acha. There is there is very important geographical concept you can add. Can you think of something? Can you think of something? Okay, why why plastic pollution? Okay, uh, say kaise related hai? Can you can you tell me something? One geographical concept: mouth of polluted waters, gyres, currents. Yes, yes. So our our uh, geographical angle is. द प्लास्टिक पोल्यूशन का जो स्प्रेड है एंड जो डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन है दैट इज इंपैक्टेड बाय ओशन करेंट्स ओरिएंटेशन जनरली द जायर सेंटर्स दे टेंड टू एक्यूमुलेट पोल्यूशन दिस इज ट्रू फॉर एनी पोल्यूशन आपने एड कर देना है प्लास्टिक पोल्यूशन बिकॉज इन द जायर सेंटर में The waters are relatively more stagnant, so this area tends to accumulate more amount of plastic. And yes, this kind of becomes something like the dead zones also. That is one concept. Another concept is see for most of the other pollutants, like the pollutants tend to sink towards the ocean floor maybe. Yes, but in case of plastic, because it is lighter, like and because of the thermohaline effect. So plastic pollution kya ho raha hai? It is getting concentrated in the epipelagic zones. It gets concentrated in the epipelagic zones above above the permanent okay thermoclines above the permanent thermoclines. Can I mention this? Yes. ओके जो मरीन प्लास्टिक पोल्यूशन इट फ्लोट्स सो इट डज नॉट रियली एंड बिकॉज ऑफ दिस दिस स्टार्ट्स इंपैक्टिंग व्हाट टाइप ऑफ मरीन लाइफ इट इंपैक्ट्स व्हाट टाइप ऑफ मरीन लाइफ इट इंपैक्ट्स बल्क ऑफ द सरफेस नेक्टन्स दे इंपैक्ट द डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन ऑफ द सरफेस प्लैंगटन्स सरफेस नेक्टन्स and surface planktons in the epipelagic zones but say can you see geography coming out here we want to answer to have a geographical sense it is not a pure typical okay gs answer alone geographical sense leke aao so gyre aa gaya current circulations aa gaya theek hai and you have this acha are you all aware of That that plastics are capable of absorbing more heat. Are you aware of this? Nano plastics. Ka, yes. So what will happen? The plastic pollution on the surface it also increases the ocean absorption of heat. Okay. And the more the ocean absorption of heat is like a positive feedback cycle. Okay. More amount of heat, more plastic disintegration. further absorption of more heat it now kind of becomes a positive cycle so what's happening is this plastic pollution is also uh, uh, resulting in a higher absorption 
absorption of of a heat in the ocean surface this is adding to the warming of the oceans is adding to the warming of the oceans agar aapko itna pata hai okay now you will try to map it with the indian ocean okay the question was what the question was okay in india what is the impact on marine biodiversity acha now batao in indian ocean biodiversity what are the specifics that you know can you tell me in the indian ocean biodiversity in the indian ocean biodiversity kuch specifics batao what is what are the specifics let's see what are the specifics okay so specifics are uh, sundarbans corals okay andaman and nicobar ka corals what else what else okay theek hai fine uh, coastal uh, plastic pollution and probably impacting the migratory species like olive ridley turtles but say i am i have no clue what to write here remember this i am developing the answer right now with you guys okay let's see how much how much we can think and write okay sundarbans ka corals andaman nicobar ka corals lakshadweep corals okay the one impact uh, you can tell me how how are the impacting like i just told you right now more absorption of the plastic more global warming will result in higher coral bleaching it result in higher uh, coral bleaching okay uh, coastal uh, plastic pollution and impact on the migratory olive ridley turtles yes okay so lot of uh, species so i can mention this here that that uh, plastic pollution can enter into a uh, 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 marine a uh, uh, food webs it can enter into marine uh, nutritional uh, nutrition cycles marine nutrition cycles so what can this impact this can impact fisheries uh, can you mention uh, three four type of species fisheries across india yes absolutely it enters a uh, food cycle this is what's called as the bioaccumulation bioaccumulation give me examples uh, hilsa okay theek hai okay <laughs> whatever fish is you know <laughs> you can't go wrong with four five varieties remember this okay you can't go wrong with you can't go wrong with uh, uh, your 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 coastal uh, uh, coastal uh, crabs you can't go wrong with herring okay nahi nahi rohu is fresh water <laughs> uh, dugongs i do not know if they are in indian coast they are like your seals dugongs are in antarctica and arctic region uh, rohu is fresh water uh, rohu yes hilsa is okay hilsa to fir bhi hum i can tolerate ki theek hai you know a bit of marine thing yes park bay a park bay has dugongs okay tuna you can't go wrong with tuna every every waters across the world has some tuna or the other theek hai so itna to kar hi sakte ho ya char panch naam bata sakte ho na see my whole objective is to give you a thinking some kind of a processed approach okay so can you not mention plastic pollution okay plastic pollution and there is uh, there is uh, uh, about about a uh, 20% decline in in uh, arabian sea uh, plankton pollution uh, sorry population 20% decline in arabian sea plankton population makes sense this is one one discussion and finally what's the impact of this so long term impact long term impact of plastic pollution of indian ocean you know should know the answer the answer is in general okay the marine biodiversity loss okay in general the impact on coral uh, say populations it impacts uh, fishing based uh, livelihoods okay and long term 
plastic pollution can also impact ocean circulations impacts oceans because of higher heat ocean circulations okay now can you tell me what can be done pehle batao aapko kya lagta hai indian ocean ke liye india ne kya kiya hoga forget about what the answer is what do you think what could have india done okay for indian ocean regulation of acting no dumping ban of single indian ocean specific batao na kya kya hoga india ne okay so number one is number one is india hasn't done enough you can't be wrong on this much of these uh, pollutions these are not covered under unclos they are not covered under unclos they are not even covered under marpol okay there is uh, no coastal authority beta ye plastic pollution is a new thing we have discovered na okay the new thing so we need some kind of an effort for plastic so remedial measure of course so the remedial measures remedial measures largely are around mitigation we are trying to uh, uh, reduce uh, coastal pollution maybe crz can help but i doubt the way they have framed it pass ek paragraph finish that off did you understand how to manage such questions now uske baad jitna aapko gyan dena de dena okay ye hum tourist hain jaate hain jitna panni milta hai utha ke apne pocket mein rakh lo that types okay we must have uh, education in school awareness for reducing plastic pollution okay uske baad jo likhna hai likho aap koi bhi dikkat nahi the fact is plastic pollution is not expressively covered under any of the major ocean pollution or ocean environmental management strategies is a problem we have identified last 5 or 6 years and that's about it